So we're having a little look at this um, Janome needle threader. We've got the machine propped up just to make um, access a little easier and also visually it's much much easier just to peer in with the front of the machine propped up. Um, first thing to say about needle threaders in general are that they're very susceptible to bent needles. So if there's any hint of a problem with the needle threader, first thing to do is to change the needle, not to check it because you really won't be able to see um, any deviation, any very, very small deviation which could be affecting the needle threader. It is best to just change it for a brand new needle. And size is important. The needle threaders generally are only designed to work from 75, size 75 needle and up. So if we, if we go in 70 or 60 size needle, it's important that we don't use the needle threader because it will get damaged. So on this particular Janome um, threader, a bit more automatic than some of the other more manual ones, needle or thread position is very, very important. And we've got the thread there through to the guide on the needle clamp. And we must make sure that that thread is all the way over to the left before we continue in and up into seven and then we're going to cut off at eight and then in one action needle threader comes down and threads the needle um, it as i say it is important that that thread is all the way on the left and the needle's not moved once the thread is positioned if the three needle threader doesn't work first time it's important to strip back and re-thread from the beginning to make sure the thread is sitting correctly before we try the needle threader. Uh, hope that helps.